Good evening. Floyd County, Mud Creek, Hazard, Florida, many places that I, they tell me that they see me on WLJC. WLJC has been a lot to me. It's been my life. It's been my comfort. It's been my enjoyment. I love WLJC. This is good news to be able to come and be able to worship, be able to lift up the name of Jesus. And this is where it's all at. Come on down. If you need prayer, come on down. I don't care what time you walk in. Come If you want love, come on down to WLJC. You'll get love, you'll get mercy, you'll get compassion, and that's what it's all about. I love WLJC. Good evening, and welcome to the service tonight. Well, as a weather report, I guess we could say we had some sunshine today. I didn't see much snow melting, but, but anyway, uh, there was some sunshine. It gave us some hopes that we was going to see springtime. And it's not nearly as cold tonight, so we, we hope that you're in a better mood and a warmer place to where you can enjoy the singing tonight. And uh, we have a, a group that I believe you will enjoy uh, tonight. We have a praise report to start out with. Uh, we had on the replay last night, we had um, uh, someone called and uh, gave her heart and life to the Lord. And so that is wonderful on our replays. And so we just want to welcome each of you to stay tuned now because uh, we, we have... Um, some scripture, and then we have some good singing by some young people. We're in hopes that all these young people coming is going to, it's going to kind of boost us up and help us not to maybe get a little younger. So, <laughs> so, so anyway, we can hope and we can dream, can't we? Well, let's read some scripture, and then we have some a prayer request for we want to take care of before we get in to the to the singing tonight. Uh, Let's go to Matthew, the fifth chapter. And you know, like I say many times, when you really want to know something and you, uh, I want to hear what the words that Jesus said. You know, words are really powerful. Death and life are in the power of the tongue. You can either bless people, encourage them, and lift them up, or you can criticize and, and talk mean to them and beat them down. But uh, these are the words of Jesus. And uh, <clears throat> the fifth chapter of Matthew. And seeing the multitudes, he went up into the mountain, and when he was set, his disciples came unto him, and he opened his mouth and taught them, saying, Blessed are the poor in spirit, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are they that mourn, for they shall be comforted. Blessed are the meek, for they shall inherit the earth. Now, blessed are they which do hunger and thirst after righteousness, for they shall be filled. Blessed are the merciful, for they shall obtain mercy. Blessed are the pure in heart, for they shall see God. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called the children of God. Blessed are they which are persecuted for righteousness' sake, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are you when men shall revile you and persecute you and shall say all manner of evil against you falsely for my sake. Rejoice and be exceedingly glad, for great is your reward in heaven. For so persecuted they the prophets which were before you. 
ye are the salt of the earth. But if the salt has lost its savior, wherewith shall it be salted? It is therefore good for nothing but to be cast out and to be trodden under foot of men. Ye are the light of the world. A city that is set on a hill cannot be hid. Neither do men light a candle and put it under a, a bushel, but on a candlestick that it giveth light unto all that are in the house. Let your light so shine before men that they may see your good works and glorify your Father which is in heaven. You know, I believe that as the, as the Lord does good things for us, then we are to tell about it. We're to share that information with others because it always encourages people. When, when you have a good praise report, when you have a good doctor's report, or uh, the Lord has met your needs in a special way, and you share that with someone, it lifts them up and it, and it brings glory to the Lord because he is still in the prayer answering business. And so tonight we have a lot to be thankful for and a lot to praise him for. And so as, as our, uh, to let our light shine, so let's share what we know about the Lord. And still it will, it will be so small compared to, to how much that he really has done for us. All right, we, uh, we, just before we uh, uh, pray, we have some uh, uh, prayer requests here. Uh, Virginia needs prayer, having trouble with her colon. Jackie from Indiana was in a bad car accident uh, and is uh, at the hospital. Oh, while she was at the hospital, she found out she had cancer. Mary uh, has called for uh, her nephew, Ronnie Burns, that's in the Hazard Hospital with a bad asthma attack, and he is a Christian. And then... Uh, uh, I talked to a couple of ladies tonight that uh, really, uh, uh, really needs prayer, and also uh, a couple of my great grandchildren. Uh, they have the flu and pneumonia and um, a lot of complications, and they're just very, very sick tonight. And so are the parents, and so they they're asking for prayer and. Only God could bring bring all of that together, so uh, we're dependent on him. Uh, and tonight we want to uh, remember uh, Ina Price from Cynthiana. Um, she's going to be having a birthday on February the 5th, so in case that we get busy and forget it by then, we want to dedicate her a song tonight. Ina Price of Cynthiana is celebrating her birthday on February the 5th. And so, so let's, let's pray right now. Let's pray for the young people that, uh, that the Lord will anoint them and bless them and help them be free to, to do what they can for him. Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you for the word tonight. We thank you, <clears throat> Lord Jesus, for these words that you have spoken and they're still as live today as it was the day you sp uh, spoke it to the disciples. We know that these are the blessings that we can expect if we do our part. And so, Father, as we go into this service, I pray that you'll help people to focus in on their relationship with you. And we know this is the most important thing in the world, is our relationship with you. And if there's something missing in, in that, we pray for a healing to take place. We pray for forgiveness to take place. Whatever the needs are, Lord, we ask you to bless uh, those that will, will have joined us. And we ask you to bless our, our singers and the phone operators. And Lord, we cannot do anything without you, but we, we love you. We love to follow you. And we want this service tonight to be a real blessing to our, especially our elderly people and our shut-ins. In Jesus' name, amen. All right, tonight we have, uh, <clears throat> we have uh, a group. Now we start, it says, Kentucky Mountain Trio. Now how many is in a trio? Tell me, people. I believe, I believe that if we can count, uh, maybe we need to go back to school, but I believe there's more than than a trio over here, but there's some good musicians, and uh, I'm sure. And these are the original Mountain Trio 
Kentucky Mountain Trio from uh, Corvin, and they do have CDs. Oh, that's what I was waving this around here for, to remind you, 606-376-2498, and uh, they are ready to uh, sing. We believe uh, that they have some new songs and they have this new recording, so let's welcome this uh, young people's group. We just want to say that we're thankful to be here tonight. Um, thankful that God allowed us to be here. Um, for the trio, whoever was wondering, we started out with three and we just kept on adding. So, But this first song that we're going to do is called I Just Want to Thank You, Lord. And You know, we, we always have something to be thankful for. We can never, ever thank Him enough for all that He's done for us. I just want to thank you. just what God can do, and that's anything. All he said we had to do was ask him. It's called He Saw It All. Thank you. 
This song um, talks about how we have a choice, you know, we have a choice to go to heaven or hell. We have two choices, and he gave us all one. It's called, You Don't Have to Go Home, But You Can't Stay Here. called the power position it's a new song we just uh, have done it a couple times so just say a prayer for us There's a place I go for power 
It's where grace first met me in the power position. Calm the raging sea. I'm not perfect in this world below. I'm forgiven when I fall into the power position. I'll go ahead and tell you who we are for those of you who don't know. Um, over here next to me on the guitar is my husband, Ryan Greer. Next to me on the bass is my first cousin, Brandon Clark. Over here on the mandolin is our newest mandolin player. His name is Jordan Foster. And over here helping us out on the guitar is Rocky Moses. And we're the Kentucky Mountain Trio, and we're thankful to be here tonight. We hope something we say or do blesses you. This next song is a song that we've, I don't think we've ever done it before. It's called Daniel Prayed. Y'all pray for us. I heard about a man one day who wasted not his time away. He prayed to God every morning, noon and night. He cared not for the things to creep, but trusted God to set him free. Oh, Daniel prayed. Oh, Daniel prayed every morning. Because he would not honor him, but he prayed to God. 
This next song we're going to do is called uh, Someday, and uh, I'm the singing lead on it. And, uh, I've only been playing with these guys for a f- couple, three weeks or so, so uh, we haven't got a lot of practice on anything I do, but this is called Someday, and uh, y'all just pray for us that it goes good. Someday when my last line is written, someday when I've drawn my last breath. When my last words on earth have been spoken And my lips are sealed in death Don't look on my cold form in pity Don't think of me as one dead It'll just be the house I once lived in My spirit by then will have fled I'll have finished my time here allotted, but I won't be in darkness alone. I will have heard from heaven the summons to come on home. And when my body is in the grave, don't think that I'll be there. I won't be dead but living in the place Jesus went to prepare. And after all is said and done, know that my last earnest prayer is that my loved ones be ready someday. God took a man like that. <clears throat> when I was a young man, I lived fast and I lived hard, fought my demons. They left way too many scars on my heart. On my mind and on my soul, that led me down a dark and dead end road. Till one night at rock bottom, I read about a man that even loved the ones that drove nails in his hands. It took a man like that to make me open up my eyes. It took a man like that to make me want to change my life. It took a man like that to save my soul and set me free. It took a man like that to love the devil right out of me.
the new me. It's all right, never turn around, I was too far gone. Oh, but look at me now, I'm right on track. Right here where I need to be. That's what happens when you fall down on your knees. And I know I'm not perfect, you know there was only one. He died for me, the Father's only son. It took a man like that to make me open up my eyes. It took a man like that to make me want to change my life. It took a man like that. Save my soul and set me free it Took a man like that to love the devil right out of me it Took a man like that to love the devil right out of me We'll try and one now and this one's a song that the Lord gave me and I think it's something, you know, as all of us Christians, you know, we, we should do a whole lot more of, and that's stand up for God. I hope the song blesses you.
had a request to do this song, and I know a lot of people love this song. Um, I want to send this out to Mava Flora, um, Gary Epperson, and um, Nita Eggers, also known as Gan Gan, and um, Aline Pippinger. They're all special people to me and all of us, and this song goes out to them. And Sharon and Kelly Dalton and Bobby Dalton and Jan. <laughs> Just everybody. <laughs> I know your love on earth was troubled and only We'll give them a little break, the Kentucky Mountain Trio and musicians. I'm uh, giving Heidi a hard time over the name here, but uh, that's all right. It's, if I could sing like they could, I'd, I'd choose my own name too. So she can uh, choose whatever. But anyway, the Kentucky Mountain Trio, the original uh, group is where the name came from, but they have a brand new CD. And uh, if you'd like to order it, 606-376-2498. And we have a number of calls that has come in uh, expressing their 
enjoyment for this group. Our grandmother has called prayer for her grandson. She said she wishes more young people would be working for the Lord. From Mount Sterling, really enjoying the group and wanted them to introduce themselves again. Here's another one just said how they enjoyed the music and uh, uh, Myrtle from uh, Floyd County, that the young ones are doing a great job and she's appreciating it. And we have this one from Clark County for uh, Billy Charlie Ingram uh, that's having a birthday and wanted to hear Amazing Grace. Um, well, I'm not sure if they do that one or not. But anyway, here's a few prayer requests uh, that we'll just put in while they're taking a break, and then they'll be back to sing for us very shortly. Juanita Smith is uh, still having health problems and needs. The doctor's not able to really pinpoint a problem, but we, we know the one that knows all about it, and we're trusting him to do that. Pastor uh, Wade Hughes from Frankfurt, he's been here um, different times to sing, and his son, Charles, is in the VA hospital with pneumonia tonight. That's Pastor Wade Hughes' son uh, is in the hospital with pneumonia. All right, from London, two grand nephews are in critical condition at UK. They were born too early and also a daughter that has the flu. Mary from Corbin is very sick and, and uh, WLJC is her church. This one is for Sean that has cancer and um, I'm not sure uh, something else there. Robert at UK Hospital. Uh, Nerva from Barberville's in the nursing home. R uh, Robbie from Lexington is just one week old and already needing prayer. Um, from, here's someone else at UK with cancer, a grandson that uh, needs prayer, a brother that's in the nursing home and a lady that has back problems. Aubrey from, uh, Audrey from Letcher County uh, for Vance that's in the hospital with blood problems. And someone um, is, ha Betty is having surgery tomorrow from Somerset. So see, there's a lot of people to pray for. So if you have everything's well with you and you're not feeling a real big, uh, need to pray, well, just think about all the ones that um, uh, that we will mention here tonight and those that we know that have recently lost the loved ones. They're trying to adjust uh, to that um, change in their life, and uh, they're missing that loved one, and so they need, they need prayer. Well, the group is coming back in, and I believe they're uh, since they're young, they can bounce back quickly. So I like that. They got enough energy for all of us. So that's, that makes it good. And we do appreciate uh, this, uh, this group of young people. I don't think any of them is ready to sign up for Social Security, do, are they? <laughs> Not hardly. A lot more songs to sing before then. And they're doing a great job. And everyone's calling and enjoying the music, so they're very humble to to be as talented as they are, and so we we thank the Lord for that. So let's welcome Kentucky Mountain Trio plus musicians, okay? <laughs> we'll try and one now. This is a very true song. It's called "If You Don't Love God, Then You Don't Love Your Neighbor," or "If You Don't Love Your Neighbor, Then You Don't Love God." <laughs>
tells us that we must have mercy. There's a special warning in the 35th verse. For you don't love God. If you don't love your neighbor, if you gossip about him, if you never have mercy, if he gets into trouble and you don't try to help him, try a song now called He's the Same God and uh, we've never practiced it. We kind of <laughs> tried to run through it one time in the car on the way up here but so just bear with us. I don't know how it'll go or not but we're going to try it. <laughs> when Abraham took Isaac to the mountain so high then Isaac said, Father, there's no sacrifice. But Abraham obeyed God, and God honored him. And true to his promise, God provided a lamb. He's the same God that provided for Isaac that day. Yes, he's the same God that came down to a manger of hay. He's the same God today. Oh, it makes me want to shout. Cause he's the very same God that John preached about. Four hundred years in darkness, God spoke not a word. Then out of the wilderness, Brother John's voice was heard. He said, one is to come. And bring the good news And I am unworthy To unloosen his shoes He's the same God that provided For Isaac that day He's the same God that came down To a manger of hay the same God today, oh, it makes me want to shout, cause he's the very same God that John preached about, and he's done everything he said he would do, but come back and get me. And he'll do that too. Yeah. 
We'll try and a couple more here. This one's called God Can, and He Can, He Can Do Anything. song that the Lord gave me. It's called I'm Going Home. And one day we are. We're all going to go home.
This next song we're going to do is called That Soldier Was Me. In a dream I was dead When they crucified Jesus And in my dream I saw His great agony I ran to the man That was piercing him Pulled him away. That 
we'll try one here. Um, Brandon's wanting to try this one. This one's a good song about talking about how we don't want to go to hell, and I know I'm not going. I'm going to heaven someday. It's called There's Fire Down Yonder, and I hope that you're not going either. Oh, well, there's fire down yonder, and I don't want to go there. Man, and how he lives so well. Then we read on down about the rich man, how he lifted up his eyes in hell. Oh, well, there's fire down yonder, and I don't want to go there. There's fire down yonder, and I don't want to go there. It's hot down yonder, and I don't want to go there. Listen, well, there's one thing I know I've done wrong. I strayed away to the wilderness, and I stayed there just a little too long. Oh, well, there's fire down yonder, and I don't want to go there. There's fire down yonder, and I don't want to go there. It's hot down yonder, and I don't want to go there. Jesus, meet me. Why don't you meet me in the middle of the air? And if these wings should fill me, I'll just put me on another pair. Oh, well, there's fire down yonder, and I don't want to go there. There's fire down yonder, and I don't want to go there. It's hot down yonder, and I don't want to go there. called help is on the way and uh y'all just listen real close to the words they're real good and some of us just need them sometimes that's why i love the song so much when i heard it it's called help is on the way said, woman, don't you worry, for God sent me today. So before you even ask me, help is on the way. Just hold on a little longer, help is on the way. A brighter day.
my favorite songs um it talks it's called he will remember me and you know we have a grandma that we talk about a lot and um, you ask her who you are but she won't remember but you ask you mention the name jesus and she knows exactly who that is so no matter whatever happens in life if you're saved god will never forget you it's called he will remember me Now her sickness has robbed her It seems to get worse every day She's always confused by her memory Even forgetting her sweet we 
say a special thanks to this fine group of young people, the Kentucky Mountain Trio and musicians, and they remember they do have a new CD, and um, there's a lady from McQuarrie County called and said, really enjoying the group, and says, Heidi's daughter is watching her mama and thinks she's doing a good job, and uh, I, I figured everybody would be wanting to know where the baby was, so um, how old is she now? Tell us a little, bring us up to date on it. She'll be 15 months on the 4th of next month. Okay, she's almost walking. Almost, okay. Yeah. All she's right. getting big. All right, well, we got, you got to see her last time she's here, and so she's grown a lot, and I guess she doesn't like travel that good now because they, they get a little tired. Do you have anywhere scheduled an appointment right away that you want to mention while you're in front of the cameras? Um, Sunday will be in. Corbin at Everlasting Grace Baptist Church in the morning and then Piney Woods Missionary Baptist, I believe, that evening in Williamsburg. So. Okay. All right, Sunday. and to get more information, then call this number that's on, on here, the 606-376-2498. All right. Well, now, if you've heard where they're going to be this weekend, and uh, so keep in touch with them, and be sure and pray for these young people. They got a lot of talent, and I want to see them keep using it for the Lord. And because there's always somebody out there wanting to make a little money off of uh, talent, and uh, so we want to we want to make sure that they use use it for the Lord. So let's pray, continue to pray for them. Thank you all so much for coming. Um, from Somerset, a praise report. This group is singing tonight has really blessed them, and they are doing a great job. A grandmother has called prayer for two grandsons. They need prayer and uh, said they have enjoyed the singing tonight. A lady is called enjoying the music. A woman from, uh, listen to this Heidi, uh, from Fort Myers, Florida. Uh, thanks God for the singers. All of the WLJC's hard work is blessing for them and Fort Myers uh, appreciates all the hard work. That's from Fort Myers, Florida. All right, John from Pulaski County enjoying the group, and they're doing a, a great job. Um, all right, uh, uh, here's another person from Somerset truly enjoying the music, from Lincoln County enjoying the group. Husband died two years ago, and, uh, but they're enjoying this music tonight. A daughter is called from Pine Knot for her mother that's 91 years of age and her health is declining, wants the singers to sing House of Gold for her. Uh, a, from Knox County uh, for someone that is having uh, some physical problems and also cancer, but said they enjoyed the singing tonight. Uh, this lady says to pray for her and four little children loves watching WLJC from Menifee County for two nephews that's in the hospital with double pneumonia and a neighbor's having health problems. All right, and from Clark County, uh, we have something good here to share from Clark County. Um, someone has called tonight and accepted the Lord as their personal savior. So there is uh, another salvation report. And um, and I'm, uh, here is another, another call from Carl, and um, I'm not sure uh, what state that is from, but anyway, they, 
have accepted the Lord as their personal Savior tonight. So that is that is great. All right, we have uh, we have more more and more calls here. Um, well, um, there's so many here. Here's uh, someone having hip surgery and someone just in a lot of pain, suffering all over. And uh, here's a child that's uh, needing some help. Uh, she continually hurts herself. And so, that, you know, that means that there's some problems there and she needs to have some help. All right, a pastor uh, from Floyd County uh, needs prayer, and uh, uh, from Scott County, from Clark County, from Fayette County, for Connie and Casey, and from Madison, Clark, Laurel, Fayette, um, uh, on and on it goes, but they're, they're telling us our time is getting away, so we do thank the Lord for the ones that have called to uh, give their heart to the Lord, and so we want to we want to again pray for all all of these requests that's come in, and um, then, uh, like I mentioned, my uh, two of my little great grandkids that's really really sick tonight. They're not in the hospital yet, but one has pneumonia and the other one has a lot of complications uh, from the flu, and he's only two years old, just a little fella, so needs some help. All right, uh, let's pray. Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you for these salvation reports. We thank you for each person that has been blessed by the talent of these young people tonight. And Lord, I pray for a hedge of protection to be around these young people and help them to remember that uh, they are were born to serve you. And so uh, just pray that you'll protect them from any uh, traps that the enemy might set for them. And we pray that you'll bless the, uh, each member of their family, and Lord, help them to know that someday when this life is over, what we've done for you is the only thing that's going to last. And so for all these that are sick and suffering and uh, near death, we ask you to have mercy on them, Lord, and we just plead the blood of Jesus over their minds, their wills, and their emotions. Help them to draw closer to you, and Father, we ask for more people to come into your kingdom and to win others, share with others what you have done for them. So bless each person that has been with us. We thank you for the privilege of getting to visit in the homes of these shut-ins and these that are lonely, can't get out and go to church anymore, but thank you, Lord, that we can go into their living rooms and just visit with them at night. And so I ask you to bless them, give them a good night of rest. In Jesus' name, amen. All right, once again, let me mention about uh, the guests that we had tonight, Kentucky Mountain Trio. Their phone number is 606-376-2498. Get in touch with them, order their CD, and bless them that away. Well, uh, we are running out of time, and the Lord willing, we'll, uh, weather permitting, we'll some of us will be back again tomorrow night, but uh, right now we've got to say good night and God bless you. WLJC programs, including the live WLJC chapel service, are brought to you through your contributions of support to Hour of Harvest Incorporated. All contributions made to WLJC are eligible for income tax deductions. Thanks to all who support us. Without you, our programming would not be possible. If you would like to join our mailing list to receive our free monthly newsletter to keep you informed of what's happening at WLJC, along with our monthly guest list, give us a call at 606-464-3600 or write to us, WLJC, P.O. Box Y, Beattyville, Kentucky, 41311. Or if you would like to join our email list, log on to www.wljc.com and sign up today. It's so easy and it's free. There's sufferings untold, each one longing for Jesus. 
Sparing heart, silent cry, empty of pride and self now. Special love, one eternal.